And uh, one team that won and is headed to the regionals is the Hedgesville Lady Eagles. We're now joined on the phone by the head coach for the Hedgesville Lady Eagles, Matt Fort. How are you doing today, Coach Fort? I'm doing well. How are you? We're doing well here, and thanks for taking some time out to be with us today. And uh, your team makes it past sectionals. Another rematch from last year as you'll take on Jefferson. Yes. Yes. What uh? What did it take to get through the sectional tournament this year? Uh, just we had to play a good, solid ball. You know, it, it's kind of like softball one hundred and one. You got to play clean. You got to play together, and you can't have walks and errors. You know, that was kind of plagued us a little bit from time to time throughout the season, but uh, we managed to put it together, and we're just happy to come out with a sectional victory. And coach Fort, your team now gets a rematch against the Jefferson Cougars, the same uh, regional championships in last year. It's a daunting task a very good team in them but what are you excited for this year well i'm excited to see the girls all come together and play as a team you know that that's something that's super important and you know whoever meshes the best at the end usually comes out on top uh jefferson's a heck of a team uh we got a a heck of a task in front of us to to try to compete with them but you know as always softball 101 you got to play clean Uh, you can't have a lot of errors you can't walk people if you if you have those kinds of problems against a team like jefferson they'll make you pay Coach, ultimately your team uh, was able to get through this section this year, but uh, a little bit more competition. We saw Musselman beat you guys in that uh, senior night game for them, and uh, both games were very close in the uh, sectional tournament. So what do you think it says about your team to come off of that loss and uh, still find a way to win the section this year and what was a pretty competitive section overall for you guys? Yeah. I was just really happy to see that they didn't give up. Um, they just kept fighting and kept grinding, and uh, they put a few hits together when they needed to, and, and we just came out on top. And looking at this Jefferson team, obviously you faced them last year in the regional tournament. And uh, you know, looking at this year's team, it was a tough time when you faced them uh, this year. What have you learned uh, about this Jefferson team that you're going to try to attack here in the regionals? Uh, they, they've got a lot of firepower, and once again, as I say, you know, you can't – you can't throw them uh, pitches that they can drive. Uh, you can't have a lot of mistakes, or, or that team will definitely make you pay. They're a quality team. Your team right now, led by Kelsey Van Dyne, she had a huge game. I uh, can't remember which one it was, but three home runs in her three at-bats to get her the player of the week. Just talk about uh, her on your program and how she leads the team. Uh, Kelsey was really seeing the ball well last week, and uh, we weren't afraid at all to put her in the box. Uh, she stepped up and filled some big shoes. I'm telling you what, she uh, she was really seeing the ball well. She drove some pitches. Uh, I was very proud to see it. Coach, we know Jefferson will be a tough team. Becca Munslow is a great pitcher for them. But when looking at your team this year and uh, the numbers offensively stand out and potentially – allow your team if you can get some success against Munslow to potentially uh you know pull off an upset here and knock off this edges or knock off this Jefferson team do you feel like the strength of your team this year has been the offense and the lineup uh yes absolutely we've uh we can we can hit with a lot of teams uh the problem that we have is uh we don't want to self uh uh implode you know by having mistakes and letting the other team score a lot of runs And, Coach, you know, looking at your team, a real senior-laden team this year, we talk about – we just talked about Van Dyne, but, you know, you look at the players uh, of the likes of Copenhaver and Lachlan. uh, What has the senior uh, class meant to your team? And uh, for them to be able to kind of pull the upset this week or next week, what would it mean to them? Oh, it would be great for them. It would be something really uh, special for them. Uh, They're really trying to lead right now as a group of seniors. You know, i got seven of them. It's, it's really important, and it's really great to see them stepping up and filling that leadership role. Uh, it would be a, a Cinderella story, to say the least, for them. And, Coach, uh, best of luck, and we'll see you out there on Tuesday and for the whole tournament. All right. Well, thank you guys for having me. That was head coach. Thank you for coming on. Matt Fort, the head coach of the Lady Eagles.